Are you present, bro? Hey. Wake up. Hey. All right. I got you now. Look, bro. Have you been doom scrolling, dog? Have you been just... <laughs> You know that messes up your mental health, right? You already know that, but why do you still do it, man? Why? Have some self-respect. Look, I could make countless videos about quitting social media. If that's something you're interested in, let me know. But look, man, presence is so important nowadays, right? If you've ever heard of the book, The Way of the Superior Man, you've probably heard it mentioned a lot in self-improvement, but on the back of the book, this is a quote from the author himself. When a man's value is no longer measured by what he does, by his finances or social standing, how does he determine his worth? In our new world, a man's presence, his depth of awareness is his most valuable asset. I've read this book multiple times. Highly recommend. If you are the type of guy to be in the middle of conversation and you're, you just kind of doze off like this, or you kind of like, you know, just sway. Just kind of like looking around, just, yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't remember what they're saying anymore, but have you ever answered somebody after you haven't heard them like three times, but you just say yeah when they asked you something that wasn't a yes or no question? Hey, what time are you leaving tonight? Oh, huh, yeah, yeah. You have to stay focused on what you're doing. And there's no such thing as multitasking, so get that thought out of your mind. Right? You can't be doing homework, but at the same time be responding to your friend, and you're going to mess up your focus. Right? Well, I mean, you know what? You actually could multitask. I'll take that back. But it is 100 times more inefficient, bro. I guarantee it. That time that it could have taken you to finish that homework assignment and then text your friend, maybe let's say the homework assignment took 15 minutes and then it took you, what, three minutes to respond to your friend? Now, it takes you, I don't know, what, half hour to do that homework assignment because you spent that three minutes in the middle of your work, right? There's also a book that I've read called Deep Work by Cal Newport, and he goes into that. He talks about not losing your focus on one task. You know what? Shoot. I'm going to pull up the book because it is very interesting. All right, I'm back. Deep Work by Cal Newport. All right. Those are two books I recommend, The Way of the Spirit Man and Deep Work. Now, the art of staying focused is very difficult nowadays, especially, especially, especially if you have TikTok. If you have TikTok, I don't respect you. I think somebody needs to say that to you. If you still have TikTok, I have zero respect for you. Why? Because you don't respect yourself. You've heard all the studies about how bad TikTok is for your mind and how awful it is for your attention span. Like, there was some study, I don't know if it's completely true or not, but it's pretty scary, that goldfish now have a longer attention span than humans because the average attention span of a goldfish is seven seconds, but for a human, it's six seconds now. I guess that's when you're actually scrolling. Anyway, you've seen the memes, too, of, like, the subway surfers on the side of the screen and the... You know, like the family guy clips or something, it messes you up. You can't just watch one video anymore. I'm surprised you've gotten to this point in the video if you have TikTok. So hats, you know, hats off to you, but like, come on, bro. Delete TikTok and stop giving those limiting, you know, beliefs or excuses of like, oh, well, well, I gotta see what's on there because, well, I, I have to see it. I'll, I'll miss out if I don't. What are you missing out on? Oh, the new celebrity drama. Who cares about celebrities, dog? Oh, well, no, well, my friends are on TikTok. If there's something really important that they wanted to show you, they would just show you. Well, 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 I really like the memes on there. Memes? You can get memes like anywhere else, bro. You don't need to doom scroll on TikTok for memes. 
I think you can message people on TikTok, right? Yeah, you can message them too. If you're worried about that, like, well, I have friends on TikTok or whatever. Just add them on other things or just get their number or something. Everything that you could say to me that will try to convince me that you need TikTok, unless you make money from TikTok, unless that's like your business, sure, that's your business. I want you on TikTok because you're making money. But if you're not, if you're just a consumer, <laughs> get off it right now. So I'm just going to assume you've taken that actionable step. You know, I'll give you a second to do it right now. Pause the video right here. All right, now that you're back, you've deleted TikTok. Now what I want you to do is to start meditating. I have a full video on this channel about how to meditate, right? I went through everything, like how to start, like the app that I got, the, the different sessions that you should start with because it goes from beginner sessions, right? Like it'll teach you everything. It's not advanced, all right? Even if it's your first time meditating, that's why you should be on it. It'll teach you it in the right way, all right? And you will learn it step by step. There will be nothing, you know, overwhelming about it, all right? It'll go very slow, one day at a time, you'll figure it out. And you'll realize that meditation is actually a fun thing to do. It's nice, it feels good, and you, you don't have to be a monk to do it. It has so many benefits for you, trust me. And it'll you know, improve your attention span and your focus. After you start getting into meditation, I want you to take breaks from your phone every once in a while, right? I've done something where I put time limits on my apps and I have this downtime feature. You can find it in settings on Apple. So if you go to screen time and then you click, you know, you scroll down a little bit, it'll say downtime, turn on downtime mode and schedule it for a certain part of the day. For me, I have it started at eight o'clock at night and it goes until like 5.59 in the morning because then I wake up at six, right? So for that time, I'm not on my phone. And that's huge because that gives me enough time to wind down before bed and get to sleep. Those are just a couple of little things that you can do to improve your focus and improve your presence. You know, as a wise man once said, formerly known as Master Ugwe, he said, yesterday is history. Tomorrow is a mystery. But today is a gift that is why it is called the present as always keep god first good luck bro hey check out the discord i'll see you man